we are basically my organization is not in Zagreb. We are 20 kilometers south from Zagreb in rural area, and it is like uh, educational and uh, living center, eco social center, and permaculture farm. And uh, usually it is very crowded with lots of visitors and people that want to learn about uh, uh, social and solidarity economy. Uh, permaculture, uh, uh, renewable uh, energies, uh, uh, sustainable building uh, uh, models. We are all practicing uh, that there. So lots of schools are coming uh, and all people that are interested in this. Uh, right now, the place is closed uh, due to the uh, hard earthquake that hits Croatia at the end of last year. So we are still uh, renovating our place that was also hit, but um, uh, thankfully also to crowdfunding campaign and to support from many volunteers, we are on good uh, way. And at the end of May, we will again open our place. So this is one part. Uh, many of us uh, are living there and it is also, let's say, a public place where you can uh, come and uh, learn in practice uh, how to how to use sustainable, uh, you know, uh, sustainable uh, goals, not in theory, but in your daily life. That is uh, our main, uh, main purpose uh, of, of our center. Uh, but uh, basically now we are running that place more than 20 years. So um, while we were working uh, uh, more uh, on infrastructure and uh, were doing uh, good with uh, logistics we started to work uh, more with uh, other partners in society for example in public uh, municipalities and try to pursue them uh, to use uh, for example agroecology or uh, uh, public policies for social and solidarity economy that is one project that we are uh, running now and I'm really, basically, it is like a de destiny that I'm in this uh, forum now because uh, I wrote one uh, manual for our uh, local authorities how to, uh, how, to, uh, how to use public policies for social and solidarity economy. And I also um, use a lot of experience from uh, Amsterdam and from, uh, from your all campaign, uh, Cities for Futures and, and others initiatives. Uh, that is, uh, so this, that is a, a second circle uh, where we are uh, trying to uh, make some much more broad uh, impact in society. This food cooperative is also something like that. This is our own uh, community supported uh, agricultural model where we are supporting small organic farmers and every Thursday uh, we are delivering uh, food uh, on two uh, spots in uh, delivery spots in Zagreb. And uh, the third part uh, that you also mentioned, and it is also important for us, is uh, uh, this uh, uh, recent, uh, from last weekend, uh, victory of uh, progressive uh, uh, political platform, Zagreb is ours that we uh, got a huge majority in city council. We also support uh, this initiative as much as we can. I, I personally work in a uh, uh, in group for uh, green uh, for green plan uh, for, for our platform. And uh, next weekend we will have a second round for mayor. And we also have a very, very good uh, chance to also uh, got the position uh, for uh, of mayor, so this is uh, like a real uh, revolution for Croatia and uh, for our movement because uh, all of us basically started from the ground, from the streets, uh, uh, from any street actions, uh, protest, uh, many direct action, these kind of initiatives, and at some point uh, we preserve that as our uh, model of activism but also started to work uh, as a political platform and now after uh, let's say five years uh, we we uh, came to this point that is really like amazing i i when i when now when i'm uh, talking about this i still can't believe that this is true <laughs> that is so exciting and also we got uh, uh, representatives uh, in many other city councils uh, across Croatia. 
that is some uh, short uh, uh, short intro about uh, my organization and yes uh, i didn't say we are also active members of ripes as a solidarity uh, economy network of europe and we are uh, working a lot on european level also on global level and we really appreciate this um, networking and mutual support uh, even across and for, and for example uh, now when we had this situation with the earthquake we also got a lots of support uh, uh, internally from from our uh, friends and uh, users here in Croatia but also from many European uh, partners in countries I was wondering you were mentioning social solidarity economy and I know it's it's your part of repas is that a term that is uh, used or that resonates in, in, in Croatia? Uh, I know there's also work around donut economy or... Croatia, it is, uh, we are also not using uh, a, a lot, very often we are using actually the term good economy because in, on Croatia it's really, really well. Uh, for example, some UK friends told me that good economy in UK would sound like some, you know, greenwash. <laughs> uh, uh, labeling or things like that, but on creation it sounds really, really, uh, really good. Uh, we use uh, actually social and solidarity economy sometimes, especially when we are do, uh, working, uh, especially when we want to make this connection with the European network and we are working with uh, public authorities. But uh, for us it is a shame because Croatia uh, many years ago uh, on national level uh, decided to use the uh, term uh, social entrepreneurship which was even more confusing if we want to uh, if we want to use it in European context and in in the context that is not focused just on some you know individual uh, yeah. individual uh, good and good and clever ideas how to solve some of the problems problems so that's why we, why we have a national strategy for social entrepreneurship we are actually struggling with these um, labels and uh, concepts and notions but uh, that is why we decided to use uh, good economy as our own local terms and every year we are organizing a good economy conference uh, with lots of uh, good cases and examples as, as I said, uh, uh, we uh, we wanted to preserve also this um, uh, this uh, our connection to European uh, uh, context, and, and and that is why uh, some of us we are also using this solid economy and economy and or social and solidarity economy. Yeah, I was uh, curious. Uh, uh, you mentioned that you developed this um, uh, like policy and program for. To the municipality how they could work with the solidarity economy and i'm curious how was uh how they were responding to it and uh, reacting to it when you've been working with it delivering it and uh, are there plans for them to put it into action and yeah 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 so this is also a good example of uh, networking of and uh, of uh, 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 of uh, support that we from uh, um, Repas uh, as a network and its members. For example, we got a huge uh, support from RTS, that is French uh, network of municipal municipalities, regions, regions that are uh, supporting uh, uh, social and solidarity economy. But because Sophie, uh, Sophie says uh, every, uh, everything that is you know social in some parts of our society also has this. Uh, uh, stupid, uh, uh, you know, with the, with the, uh, all the uh, uh, all the systems, uh, Slavia, Slavia. Uh, so that is, uh, for example, first uh, we initiate the meeting with the RTS representatives from like their uh, deputy mayors and mayors, and uh, bring them here in Croatia. So they, they do not talk, do not talk with our uh, local representative representatives you know they are on the same level and we thought that it, it would be much more um, much more uh, easy to to uh, to understand what we want if we pick someone someone that is on their level that, that as as activists uh, telling them uh, about this now now uh, this police political platform situation is a little bit changing and we are uh, coming in situation that um, 
people, uh, polit uh, political positions that are much more, much more open to this kind of, this kind of ideas. But um, we initiate many subjects with REPAS members, with our local municipalities, and uh, through these uh, projects we teach them how to create, um, for example, uh, energy cooperative lo local uh, energy transitions, how to create a local local uh, action plan for uh, food serenity, uh, how to support uh, local public procurement. All, all, all important, uh, you know, small steps uh, we uh, shaped, shaped in one inter integral uh, public policy. And uh, we organized many trainings for them, uh, in workshop, workshops, uh, with, with, two, with two of them, action plan, we decided, decided not to go with too many, to, to work deep or deep only with the ones that are really dedicated. Maybe we are not uh, starting from the session. Uh, as I said, uh, when we are comparing, for example, uh, Balkan or Croatia with some, some more developed, I mean, more developed in economic terms, but terms, but also in, uh, in the terms of uh, movement, experience, experience. But uh, I think we, uh, uh, as you say, we all work on work on uh, energy transition. Uh, Financing, financing uh, more participatory, uh, marginal, marginalized group, uh, uh, f food sustainability. So these are all so common uh, uh, themes that maybe we will use different techniques. As I say, as I said, for example, we uh, we decided that for our. Uh, local uh, situation, it would be much wiser to invite uh, and to and to bring, you know, on political political and also and also out about public policies and not just us as an activist. So we have different different uh, tools, maybe different uh, methods at some point, but I think we are all, uh, you know, streaming to the same goal and uh, won't won't achieve achieve uh, the, uh, the same. Uh, better world so uh, I, I think at some point we will uh, especially when we start to talk to each other we will understand how much things we have and, and that we are basically that we fire fire and teach it up it, uh, each other's uh, something from our experience and from our uh, from our life from our knowledge